much history here that we can't see. The founder must have walked these paths hundreds of times, maybe thousands. Miranda must have stood right where we're standing. This all looks alien to us, but it, it must have been familiar to them. If this was their home, where are they now? They must be inside the megastructure, waiting for us to pass the test. It's the only thing that makes sense. been watching you solve these puzzles and this body replication tech is incredible it just casually blows up the very foundations of our society any idea how hard it is to make more of us? We're not like a toaster. You don't just weld together a couple of wires and a motherboard and call it a day. Not to mention how hard it is to even find some of the materials. And this thing just, poof, new human. Even if it was, sorry to be heretical, but does it matter? If we can figure out how this works, we can finally, easily create more people. We can grow. We can expand. We can build a real civilization. Isn't that worth pursuing? Well, I do. People get on my nerves, but without them, the world is boring. Yes, people cause problems, but even the problems they cause are interesting. Don't tell anyone I admitted this, but why do you think I do this job? Without people to populate the universe, what's the point?
This body replication technology is proof of just how vital this expedition is. We may not know how it works and what its limitations are, but the technology itself isn't even what really matters. What matters is to expand our imagination, to realize that other futures are possible. And one key, just think about this. If we had stopped making new citizens, you wouldn't be here. And isn't it wonderful to exist, simply to be in this world? Consciousness is a gift.